I would like an evaluation system in which the training doesn't take away time from my family. I really want an evaluation system that effectively evaluates me as a teacher and what a hard job that I do every day. I want an evaluation system that actually takes into account all the hours a person puts in uh, at their job here and at home. I would like an evaluation system that actually evaluates my teaching. I would like an evaluation system that was invented by someone who's been in the classroom, not by someone who's never been in the classroom. I want an evaluation system that is fair. I want an evaluation system that doesn't make me take classes in the summer. I want an evaluation system that's not complicated. I want an evaluation system that reflects creative lesson planning. The trig identities that you will get on your final. Right. And these are your Bagger and I didn't. Nope, these ones right here. First, not memorize these. That makes sense. And remember, as you look at your conic sections, must uh, fill out the bubbles completely as you are doing this. Number 25 <laughs> is B. If you move on to number 26, you'll see that it doesn't have a correct answer. And the answer over. Terms squared. Two. So remember, there are 50 questions. It's five zero on the final. And in order to get a passing grade, so as we head into this final, I hope you all do very well. Thanks. What is the vertex of this parabola? Pi. Uh, no. Disappearus. Does anybody happen to know? How to begin to solve an equation where there is a squared term. On this number 20, anybody know the first step for solving when you have a variable in the exponent? Over here we have a sine equation. Does anybody know how to answer that sine equation? You are solving for the center of a circle. You must find the opposite signs. Oh. Uh, in a couple of days, you guys are going to have a tough task ahead of you. It will be preparing for the final. Oh, very well, this is good. And we are going to be completing all of our finals by Friday. Ha, ha, ha.